There you go. All right. Hey, everyone. I'm Candice Terrazas. I'm an ambassador diamond. I have been with It Works for a little over three and a half years. It has completely changed our life. We paid off over $100,000 debt in our first year with It Works. And um, it was something that uh, this business, this whole industry was something that was so foreign to me. So as we get started, I just want to share with you the basics. Uh, most of you that probably got started with us, and so I'm not speaking for everyone, but there's probably a good percentage of you who have never done anything like this. And um, if you're anything like I was, I was very skeptical. I didn't really understand network marketing. I always thought it was one of those pyramid things that not everybody could be successful with. Um, with I mean, I had people straight up tell me when I started this that only the people at the top make a lot of money and that you're working for other people. And what I can surely tell you is that any one of you can surpass us um, in the income ranks. We've hit that top rank of the company, but one of you guys can be Black Diamond before Rachel, Sammy, and I. So this business is not a true pyramid in the sense that you can coach somebody and they might surpass you, and it's actually a really good thing. You still get paid on them. Um, so I just want to give you the basics of network marketing as we get started. Um, so network marketing is one of the few um, legit business industries that you can make residual income um, in one of the most simplistic business formats. Residual income, which I didn't know exactly what that meant when I started, is just getting paid over and over and over for something you've done one time. You help someone, you coach them, you guide them to be successful, and that is income that you get to generate um, until infinity. And one thing I didn't know before I started this business is that these business, businesses can actually get willed to our children. So when you talk about um, you know, legacy money, leaving money for your children's children. This is no joke, a quick way to leave an inheritance for your children's children. How amazing that you can, your children can inherit a residual income, getting paid over and over and over for something they didn't even do. So um, in a nutshell, you are now in business for yourself. And what I like to tell people is that not uh, you're, you're in business for yourself, but you're not in business by yourself. So what that means is that we are a family, like Rachel said, um, we're in this together, but you are your own boss. What you want to make of this is your choice. So you get to choose however much money you want to make in this business, however much time you want to put into it. Um, what we, one thing that I can assure you, because um, both Rachel, Sammy, and I, and so many others on this call have lived, is that when you get when you do something over and over and over, and you work hard, and you you get work harder than you're paid to do, eventually you make more than what you do. Um, the ambassador diamond checks that Rachel, Sammy, and I have seen. Um, are mind boggling. I, we have a majority of our friends who don't even, you know, the monthly incomes that we've seen, you know, making that in a whole year. And it's just, it's obviously life changing. So to um, just give you a couple stats, you know, 80% of people who join network marketing hope they will get lucky versus treating it as a career. So if that is a true statement, that means 80% of you are on this call hoping to get lucky. And what I want to give you the good news is that telling you that if you treat this like a career, like an actual business, that it will completely change your life. And we are going to change that statistic tonight and saying that 100% of you are treating this like a career to completely change your life. And so some of you might have started this business with a network. Some of you are starting without a network, which is okay. You can, we teach you how to build it. Um, so I want to tell you how, here's moving forward, here's how to never run out of prospects. Um, starting today and for the rest of your life, I want you to take every single person you meet, get their contact information, and find a creative way to stay in touch with them. Welcome to network marketing. That's exactly what we do. Um, you know, you want to stand in your prospect's shoes as you're talking to people, whether you know them or you don't. Uh, what approach would attract you? Uh, what attracted you to join the person who invited you to be in this business? That, um, you know, that would be something, you know, I also think of like, what would cause me to put my defenses up, you know? So those are things that I take into consideration as I'm reaching out and talking to people. Um, hundreds list is one of the very first things we have people get started with. A hundreds list is when you actually get a notepad out. If you don't use the formal hundreds um, list inside of eSuite, you can get a notepad out and you literally just start writing down a hundred names of people that you know, whether they are friends, they could be your plumber, they could be your electrician, they could be your hairstylist, they could be your cousin. A hundred names of anybody that you know, and that is basically how we start this. It's something that continues to grow. Um, I add people to my hundreds list every single day, and what I will tell you is that I don't know one ambassador diamond that has hit the top of this company without a hundreds list. So it's something that's very important that you want to pay attention to. Um, and the last thing I will share on this part is um, I 
grew my business to diamond in three months and got a $10,000 bonus because of wrap parties, which Rachel's going to talk on in just a bit. But um, you want to get your launch party set up. That could be online. It could be in person. But this is basically how you're going to tell your friends and family, um, hey, I'm open for business. Uh, it's what it's equivalent to a ribbon cutting ceremony that you would have if you opened up a boutique or a salon or a gym, you know, where you would tell everybody, Hey, come and welcome me and my new business that I just started. That is what a launch party is. You're just inviting your friends and family to hear more about what you're doing. Um, so I'm so excited that you stepped into this incredible journey. I know for some of you, it wasn't an easy decision. Maybe it's something you had been following for a long time. For some of you are just like, why not do this? I'm so glad I was introduced to this, but wherever you are, um, you're in good shoes. Uh, you're in good hands, and I wanted I want you to know that the the sky is truly the limit with this industry. So you just walked into a winning lottery ticket. So welcome everybody. I'm super excited to be uh, partnered with you in this journey. And we're gonna move on to Sammy, and she's gonna talk to you about the three simple ways that you earn money in this business. Yay! I'm so I'm so excited for each and every one of you. You guys have no idea. So. I'm Samantha Myers Lopez. Some of you don't know that Candy and I are actually sisters and we're ambassadors together. Isn't that exciting? Um, and Rachel was the one who signed me and then I signed Candy. And, and actually Rachel's sister signed her. So this is such a family affair here. Mm -hmm. um, so all of you guys joined to make money, right? I don't think you joined just for fun. Um, you could have just been a customer if you just wanted to use the product. So you joined to make money. So I'm going to talk to you about the three different ways we make money. Um, when I joined, my, my goal was if I could make three to 500 extra dollars a month, that would change my life. And so this is something that when Rachel told me how you make money, this, I held on to this and this is like, I followed it to a T. So the first thing, the first way we make money is wrap cash. You guys, nobody else has the wraps. We are the only company that has these wraps. They tighten tone and firm in 45 minutes. Like people lose inches, their skin tightens up. Like I've had people, it looks like they have surgery because their skin is completely different after wrapping. Like you can't get this any other way. So you gotta have wraps with you all the time. I actually carry wraps in my purse in a little bag and I take them with me everywhere I go because you would be surprised how many wraps I've sold like just out and about. Uh, I'll blitz, give a coupon card or blitz card to a waitress. She'll end up buying a wrap for me. I'm like, thank you. My waitress just paid for my meal, you know? And so, um, wrap cash is amazing. Like I don't ever go to the bank and this is all wrap cash. I never have cash on me unless it's wrap cash. So if you are not having wraps with you at all times and telling everyone, you know, about wraps everywhere you go, you are missing out on a huge portion of your income because you know what? When you first start, your commissions checks might not be that high. So you, you want, if you're like, I need money like tomorrow, wrap cash is the way you're going to get it. So wrap cash is the first way we get wraps, um, a wholesale price. We sell them retail. You can sell wraps from anywhere from 25 to $35. I have friends that sell them for 35 and people buy them. Um, if you're selling them cheaper, you're just hurting yourself just so you know. So again, carry these coupon cards pass them out everywhere you go, keep uh, wraps with you everywhere you go, and you will, just out and about, you will sell wraps, it's amazing. Um, the next thing we're gonna talk, and you can even earn like really discounted wraps, so uh, someone else is talking about that. But the next thing that I'm gonna talk about is another way to make money, which is our commission. So um, we get paid every time we sign up loyal customers and they order products, we're gonna get paid a commissions off them. And the same thing, if you sign up retail customers, say somebody that doesn't want to be a little customer, they order online, you're going to get commissions off them. Um, and then as you grow your business and you sign people to your team, you're going to make commissions off their sales. How amazing is that? So uh, that was one of the things they were saying, you're going to work really hard now. You're going to work on signing up those customers. You're going to work on helping people get healthy, helping them um, get, you know, get fit helping people with their financial goals. You're going to work right now, but eventually as that your team starts growing, as those sales come in, you're going to see that check go up and up and up and up. And that's the beauty of residual income. So our commissions are amazing. For those of you that are like, I need to know the percentages. Like just look at the compensation plan. I still couldn't tell you all the percentages because I'm not that kind of a person. Like I, Rachel was just like, this is how you make money. And I'm like, cool. Okay. Um, so I, I think I have read the compensation plan like maybe twice and I've been in the company four years, but 
Some of you, like, you need to know the details and the percentages. That's cool. Do it. Go read it. It's in your document library. Um, and so that's another way. And the third way we make money is my favorite way. It's bonuses. Yeah. So our company is completely debt-free. They are completely debt-free. And they love financial freedom. Like they, their big thing is debt free is the new sexy. Like they want us to be debt free. They want us to be walking in financial freedom. And so they offer incredible bonuses so that we can be debt free so that we can walk in true financial freedom. You know, when I joined, um, we had a lot of debt, uh, because we didn't have extra money. We were barely surviving. And so there were times we had to put groceries on the credit card or, you know, if, um, if the tires went out or something like that happened, it went on a credit card and we could just make the minimum. So that number just kept getting higher. And I remember the, the day that we were able to just write out, not a, not a check because we do it online, but you know, like pay it all online um, for our total debt, like my college loans, everything. That was the happiest day of our lives, guys. It's amazing to be debt free. So um, they offer incredible cash bonuses. There are, are multiple bonuses that you can get. There's the fast start bonuses, um, which we're going to talk about later that you can get basically weekly. It's up to you. We have, um, our, now our go and our go fast bonuses. You guys should all know about those. Basically, uh, the go bonus is if, if you go diamond in six months, which is the average time it takes a person to go diamond, you're going to get a $5,000 bonus cash. Um, but if you do it in half the time, you're going to get double the bonus. So it's $10,000. Um, the same thing, it, it goes with uh, diamond, double, triple, and so on. And you can get all of them. So it's truly, truly amazing. I think it's up to like, like if you were to get all the bonuses, you'd get over $300,000 in just bonuses. So it's, they're amazing. They're amazing. And then there's other kinds of bonuses. Like after you hit diamond, it opens you up to a whole new level of bonuses too. So the bonuses are amazing. Um, and so those are our main ways to make money. So um, now Rachel is going to talk to us about how to start growing your business. Okay. Yay. All right. So are you guys tracking with us? Everybody good so far? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Direct sales is amazing. Uh, none of us realized this until we got into it. None of us are experienced in direct sales and started, until we started doing it. I just celebrated four years and I joke with my local team all the time. Like we've been ruined for life. Now that we know what to do and how to do this, like we'll forever be our own bosses. We'll never, ever, ever want to go to nine to five again. That's how we feel after being in it for a while. Okay. Um, and so we're just trying to take the best of the best and give it to you guys. Um, all right. So after knowing like how you're, you're earning money three ways, cash commissions and bonuses, I want to talk to you guys about like, how are you going to get your commissions? Okay. Um, so getting your commissions, it can happen either two ways. You can run an 80 BV auto ship. BV just is, it's abbreviated for bonus volume. It, 80 BV would basically mean like $80 in sales volume. Okay. So, um, you'll have to kind of wrap your brain around that 80 BV. All right. So your auto ship can either be at 80 BV or above, and that will commission qualify you to pull those commissions out. Um, or you can have 150 in personal bonus volume from customers that you're personally signing up as loyals. Okay. So we talked about like signing up the for loyal customers or loyal customers, you probably like got in and you just, you're new to, or you're a new distributor. And probably the first thing your enroller said to you was let's get you four loyal customers. Okay. So as you sign up loyal customers, you'll see that volume grow in sales. Say you sign two people with wraps, you know, that's, um, a hundred and what is that? 120 in volume. Okay, one more person with wraps as a loyal customer, you're over 150 in personal bonus volume. Does that make sense? So bonus volume, sales volume, kind of pretty much the same thing. We have BV attached to every single product that we have. Some BV is exactly equal to price. Some BV is maybe not. Okay, so uh, you can always see that though in your e-suite. You can see it when you're shopping, like it's attached everywhere. Um, so you can't miss it. Um, so anyways, I just felt like that was kind of important to explain, but that, that being commission qualified either through your auto ship or through your customer sales volume, that will allow you to pull out your commission check. 
Okay. And so as you grow your business, that commissions check is going to grow. I will tell you from personal opinion, uh, Candace and Samantha, raise your hand. If you've ever not run an auto ship, have you always run your auto ship since day one? Can you just raise your hand? Have you ever skipped a month? No. No. Okay. So here's the thing. All right. Like we did not get to where we were at without running our auto ship. And here's why I think this. Okay. If I were a business owner of a brick and or mortar. Okay. If I were uh, the business owner of, I like to use donut shop or um, even a Chick-fil-A. Could I go a month without ordering product? Could I go a month order like without ordering toppings for my donuts? Absolutely not. You know, I'm going to be ordering every single month. I've got to put my investment in and then I've got to get myself out there to sell it. Is that correct? Right? So you are a business owner now. You're like officially a business owner. Um, you're an entrepreneur. I am not your boss. Candace and Samantha are not your boss. You literally are in control of your business. And so what you do with it is completely up to you. And we at work together as a team and we cheer each other on. But when it comes down to it, this is up to you. You know, you, you want to do this because you want to change your life and you want to like, you want to start making some good money. Um, you want to contribute to your family, whatever your dreams are, whether it's $500 a month or it's more than a thousand dollars a month, you can do it with this business. But I truly believe that running the auto ship puts it in your head. Like I am a business owner. I have something to do this month. I need to get it done. You know what I mean? And so, right girls, is that, is that how it works for you too? Okay. It like makes it official and legit. Like you're a legit business owner, your product's coming out, you're selling it, which also makes it that we're not a scam. Okay, we're not a pyramid scheme. We are a true direct sales network marketing company. We have product coming in, we have product going out. We're signing up customers, we're enrolling representatives. We are official in that realm, okay? And so um, anyways, that is why it's very important and that's why we really encourage people and that's why I just spent like five minutes explaining the auto ship because it is so important. So I personally, like if you're on here and you're listening to this and you turn it off, turn it back on because it really will drive you because you're going to purchase that and then you are responsible for it. You know what I mean? You're like, I'm going to sell this stuff. Like, I'm either going to have a rap party. I'm going to go around. I'm going to get a festival, whatever. I'm going to get rid of this. I'm going to be handing out stuff like Samantha was talking about. Um, so I really think it's important. It is really a driving factor. And then you'll never have to worry about missing out on a paycheck. I've seen girls turn off their auto ship and they, someone didn't quite make enough 150 personal bonus volume orders, right? As customers, and they missed out on their commissions check that month. And it was like $500. That would suck. And then you don't get it. Okay. So don't, don't, it's not Russian roulette. Just run your business the right way. Um, okay. Steps to success. This is my favorite part because I joined this business. I had no idea what I did. Like I didn't go through a party pad. I literally just signed up because I saw the income chart and I saw $500 a month and I was like, I want to make that. I had no idea what this business involved. Okay. And so very quickly I learned what the steps to success was. And I learned that if I did the steps to success each month or more, that I would be able to be successful and I would make $500 a month. I would make $1,000 a month. Okay. So like, that's really all I believed. I didn't even believe the rest of the income chart. I thought they were liars. I was like, they just put it in there to like make you think, you know, like I'm a, I was part of it works and I still didn't believe that the income chart was real. I was like, I just believe this bottom half, you know? And so anyways, I was like, okay, how do I do this? Um, and I, I believe, yeah, Candace is going to talk to you about promoting, but I learned that if I work my steps of success, I can promote up the, those ranks, the income chart, Google the income chart. You guys, you need to print it out, stare at it, look at it because it's real. Okay. And once you figure out how to do it, you're going to start doing it over and over and over. And you're going to start really making a lot of money, but it really just comes down to steps of success. And that is enrolling four loyal customers. If you write anything down on paper, this is all you need to do. Make money equals four loyal customers and three distributors do it every single month. That's basically, if you break it down one a week, one customer a week, one distributor a week, that's all you're doing. Okay. And you may be consistent with your business and building it every day, but your goal by the end of the week is to have one customer plugged into your account and one distributor plugged into your account. That's it. Okay. So we're going to teach you kind of like how to make that happen. Um, but that's how you're going to make money. All right. And like, we may not follow it perfectly to a T you guys. So if you can't, if you didn't quite hit it this month, you're like, all right, 
I'm going for it. You know, like it's not over until the last minute of the last hour of the last day of the month. All right. And then it starts over and then you get to do it again and you can shoot for it again. But this is the thing is that if you are consistent with your steps to success, you guys, you will go as far as you want in this business. And that is what I have learned over time. And so I learned that. And in five months I got to diamond. And then in six months I went double diamond and that's about a $5,000 paycheck. I was so excited. It completely changed our family's life. And so it wasn't like I just, I just got in and I started making money because I learned the steps of success. And then I figured out how to chart, which is what Candace is going to teach next. And then I started hitting the ranks and making money that I could not believe. And which even brought me up into over like five figures a month. Okay. And so that is really exciting when you're working from your phone and you're doing this business and you're making really, really good money. So, um, all right. Auto ship steps of success. Steps to success, steps to success. I want you to dream about it. Think about it, eat about it. Like think about enrolling representatives and enrolling customers all the time. That's all your goal is. Okay, and then you wanna teach your team to do the same thing as they come in. Four loyal customers. All right, every time you sign up two loyal customers and you keep them, okay? And, and we're not gonna to try to explain everything else right now. But like every time you sign up two loyal customers and you keep them, you are gonna get a wrap reward. Wrap rewards means you get a box of wraps for $25. Instead of it being 59, it's only 25 bucks. Okay, so with that entire box of wraps for only $25, imagine if you sell them for $30 each. Okay, you've made your money back plus, so total, you'd be making $120 minus your investment. So that's like pretty much 100 bucks in your pocket. Okay, and like what Sam, what can't, or Sam, blah, Sam Mantha. <laughs> was saying, I just got two sisters all mixed up. Um, Samantha was saying was that that wrap cash really gets you by in the beginning of this business as you're really building it. And it's so true for me too. My wrap cash, I was banking. I was like, I have $500 in wrap cash. I was like, look at all this money. I was so excited. Oh my gosh. Like it is the best thing in the world. So put the wrap on people and wrap yourself, put the wrap on people, take pictures, pictures, tell the story. You don't have to try to explain your product at all. Let me just take a picture of your tummy. Let me put this wrap on you or your arms or your neck. I'll just, let me just take a picture. Let me get that wrap on you. And then let me take it off and take a picture. That's really all you have to do, okay? The pictures will tell. Um, and then always follow up that 72 hour photo because it's so important. Um, okay, yep, so that's, that is what I was supposed to talk about. Now it's Candace's turn. You need to unmute her. She's muted. <laughs> okay. All right. And oops. I'm sorry. <laughs> I didn't know it was unmute. Um, okay, guys. Oh no, she's hold on, kids. <laughs> there must be a delay. I unmuted you. There Here we go. Okay. Can you guys hear me? Yes. All right. So steps to success is your business plan, as Rachel just discussed. So this is good for you to know, because when people ask you, how does this work? Um, you just tell them our business plan is the same, whether you're brand new, you've been doing this for years. And so it's basically what Rachel just explained right now. So I want to talk to you about um, how to grow your, how to actually grow your business, because we, uh, I know when I started, I kind of wanted to know, like, what's more important? Do I sign customers? Do I sign distributors? And they're both equally important. Customers are what pay you and distributors are what promote you. So yes, you can still make money if all you did was sign customers. However, that's not utilizing and maximizing the compensation plan. So I have like salons and doctors and, um, and med spas where they don't, they're not in this to make like big residual income. They're fine making, you know, a, couple, a few hundred dollars a month and they just, you know, they sign up customers and maybe a distributor here and there. However, when I started this, I knew I needed this to work. It was a business for me. Um, it meant either this or I was putting my baby in daycare and I was going to have to go back to work. And even then we weren't going to be able to pay off our debt with any other job. So um, I treated it like a business. So if you want to work this like a business, um, you want to make sure that your first thing that you do, if you have not seen already, uh, print out that Ruby chart. Um, so Rachel said one other thing, the income disclosure, I'm sorry, the, the income charts are really, really important for you to see because, uh, they're real numbers. Uh, just like Rachel, I thought that the numbers on the right hand side of the income chart were just not real. Like maybe people up north made that kind of money, but I didn't think real people did. 
But, you know, um, making getting to Ruby in your first two months is very doable. A lot of people hit Ruby in their first month to two months. Um, so it's my first goal when I personally sponsor someone to help get them to Ruby in their first two months. Uh, the reason why this uh, rank is what I think one of the most important ranks in the company is because every rank after Ruby is made up of Ruby. So if you can go Ruby, Ruby's average three to six hundred dollars a month. You can now teach anybody that you sponsor into your business um, how to make five hundred dollars a month. And guess what? As you're guiding people to hit Ruby, you are moving up the ranks as well. For example, going diamond. Right now, there's a $10,000 bonus for going diamond in your first three months. So if you signed up any time in March, you have until the end of June to be diamond and you get a $10,000 bonus. What is diamond? I'm glad you asked because a diamond is just having three people on your team. They have to be strategically placed and we have charts in place to help guide you with that. But three people that go Ruby. So if you can guide three people who want to use an extra three to $600 a month, that will get you close to going diamond and getting that, uh, that $10,000 bonus diamonds average about $2,000 a month. So this is a uh, big money. I think most people can pay, you know, the rent or mortgage, uh, with that, that kind of, um, extra paycheck in their home. So, um, and you know, just to give you a statistic, uh, like 99% of people sign up for this business for me, it was an extra 500 to a thousand dollars a month. Um, there's another statistic that shares that most people would not go into foreclosure if they made an extra three to five hundred dollars a month so really think about that because there are people that you might right now think that you would never reach out to but you just don't know what situation they're in and if they made an extra five hundred dollars in their home they just might be able to save their house um so how to maximize the compensation plan i wanted to share this quickly um without i mean there's a lot more details but we'll probably do another training soon on the compensation plan but i just want to share with you um even though i tell everybody that your goal should at minimum be ruby i would love for every person to at least strive for diamond because diamond is when you literally have the ability to write your own paychecks mm -hmm. um there is a leadership bonus uh, diamonds diamond and above is considered leadership for um the it works company and if you can go diamond you can now uh be able to make unlimited paychecks as a diamond because of the leadership bonuses. So if you go diamond, um, you can get, not only do you get, so Sammy talked about the fast start bonuses. Those are the weekly bonuses you get for personally sponsoring someone. So if you sign up to distributors this week, they get two customers under them. That makes them fast start qualify. You will have $200 in your bank account next Friday. Every person you sign up, they get two customers. That's a hundred dollars and it's paid weekly. So write that down because if you have somebody that you're talking to that's thinking about starting this business and they need a fixed income, like friend, if I do this, I need to make $500 by the end of this month. You know what you need to do. Aside from that awesome wrap cash, Sammy and Rachel talked about, uh, you know, fast start bonuses. You know, my first month I made 800 bucks and that was huge. That was between wrap cash and uh, fast start bonuses. I had a few distributors that I signed up, helped them get their customers and, you know, having those weekly paychecks. I thought like, this is it. That's really why I signed up. And I didn't think that was going to happen until months down the road. Well, guess what? When you go diamonds, not only do you get $100, but you get an extra $80 leadership bonus on every single person you sign and every person they sign, as long as you sign them up after diamonds. So that can be really huge. If you go diamond and then you sign up Mary, not only do you get that extra 80 leadership bonus on top of your 100, but if Mary signs five people and one of them under them signs five people, another one signs two people, you know, like that's 80, 80, 80, 80, 80. Can you see where I'm going? These leadership bonuses are unlimited. Um, there are some people in this company who've seen, um, you know, massive five figure, uh, just leadership bonuses in their paychecks. That's not including their residual. That's not including any kind of bonuses. This is just the leadership portion of their paycheck. So, uh, I just really want you to get vision for that because if you can get vision for diamond, um, I believe that every single person on this call tonight can go diamond by the end of June and get that $10,000 bonus and start seeing those really big paychecks as a diamond. Um, again, I'm not a compensation uh, guru, but I have, I actually didn't read much of the compensation plan until I went presidential diamond. I remember seeing a paycheck that was over $20,000 in a month. And I remember uh, getting a little bit scared, like, where is this coming from? Is this real? Like, is this legal? You know, how am I making all this money? And um, when I ran through the compensation plan, I was like a deer in headlights. Like, why was I not doing something like this a long time ago? And it just got me on fire to teach my team and get more people to be able to make um, those legacy changing paychecks. You know, that's uh, the, the being able to pay off your debt and helping other people pay off their debt is uh, one of the most freeing things and one, one of the most joyful parts of working this business when you don't have to have, um, you know, even just to share with you guys, 
another statistic. I'm awful with statistics tonight. The number one reason for divorce is financial, um, you know, burdens in people's homes. And not that my, my husband and I were, you know, near that, but we fought a lot and there was a lot of division in our home uh, because of finances prior to it works. And it's just been something that has enriched our marriage that we've been able to be a full-time family. So, um, so even though you might've started to make $500 a month, that's amazing. But if you, um, you know, feel it stirring in your heart that this could be something bigger, I just want you to know um, it's because it can, and we have all the tools in place to help you uh, get there. So uh, the next thing we're going to do is we're going to move on and talk to you guys about um, social media. Social media is just an incredible way to build your business. Um, all three of us use our social media as one of the platforms to build our business. So Rachel's going to share with you um, how to be strategic, how to not annoy, annoy your friends, and how to, um, how, how to work in an influential way. All right. Okay. So... Um, here's a few things that I just wanted to go over. Uh, if you haven't actually announced that you've started, you need to do that right away. Uh, post on Facebook, uh, let people know, say, Hey, oops, hold on a bit. Do I need to mute some people? I don't know. I heard some noises, but, um, so basically like just announce like, Hey guys, I'm so excited. Do a selfie, cute selfie, like, uh, you know, whatever. <laughs> And say, I'm so excited. Or maybe do one with your kids if you're uncomfortable doing one by yourself. And let the, let the public know, I just launched my new business. I'm so excited. I cannot wait to share more with you. Even if it's just that. Maybe it's not even about it works. You have to think of yourself like a teacher. Like if you were to go in to kindergarten and teach algebra, would any of the kindergartners know what you were talking about? No. They'd be like, what? I don't even know. what. Or even if you try to teach kindergartners multiplication would they understand that no it'd be so foreign to them okay so like as you are working towards the public you have to think of yourself like this even with your friends your family you're getting all this information but they're clueless okay so as you put stuff out there make sure that you're wording things that they understand so take them on a journey okay don't just like go hey join my team let's go ruby nobody's gonna know what you mean um but if you kind of like go in and dip your toes in the water and start posting and then make it a regular thing, then people are going to really buy into that. They're going to be really excited about it. Okay. And so, um, you know, think about that as you post like, Oh, I'm so excited. I just started this new adventure. I can't wait to tell you more. And then maybe like your box comes in and be like, Oh my goodness, I'm so excited. Look what just came in. It's my new business. I can't wait. You know what? I've actually got four, of their top selling product in my hand right now and I want to put it on four people. So the first four people to message me will get this wrap with $5 off or whatever, you know? And you're like, I've got a body wrap that firms, tightens, and tones your skin. The first four people to message me gets this wrap with a $5 discount, you know? And so you're gonna sell it for 25 instead of 30. So keep it exciting. Like if you're posting on Facebook, which when you post on Facebook, you're posting to a hundred or more friends. Say you've got a hundred friends, two, five, hundred, a thousand. You've got a platform that you're speaking from and you can do it every single day. But I like to look at posting you guys on Facebook, like an advertisement. You go to work and you drive by the same advertisements every single day. How often do you notice them? You know, you're looking at them, but is that what's going to draw you in? Probably not. But when you get a coupon in the mail or you get a thoughtful message from that same business that's advertising, say it's like a doctor's office or whatever, and they send you like a, maybe it's a realtor and you keep seeing the same realtor picture over and over and over, but then you get their realtor thing in the mail and it's a magnet and you're like, oh, that's so cute. And you put the magnet up there and then you see their face every time, you know, and then eventually when it's time, they're going to call you. So it's like, that is what Facebook is like. Okay. Social media, Instagram, it's just a constant reminder of what you're doing. Sometimes people will hit you up from seeing that, but most of the time that's not going to happen. So I believe in this like trifecta of three things that are really important as you're growing your business. Number one, most important thing is that you're posting and you're putting yourself out there and your information, the product that you have, the product you're highlighting, the opportunity, the excitement, fun, friendship, freedom. Basically, that's how you want to post, okay? Your posts need to have fun, friendship, freedom. And if you put them through that filter and you say, is this fun? Is this like inviting friendship? Is this freedom? And if you can't say like, well, no, this kind of sucks. Like I'm kind of being a down Debbie downer. Like when I'm posting this negative Nancy, then be like, okay, I'm not posting that, you know, like filter through those like fun, friendship, freedom. Are you having a good time? Then 
So the trifecta is what I think is posting and then messaging. Messaging is so important, you guys. If I wouldn't have asked people to join me, I'd still be Ruby. I would not be an ambassador. I would not be, okay? I would not complete my steps to success every month if I didn't message people. So you have to ask, and that's what that 100s list is for. You're gonna have a 100s list, and you always wanna add to it. That doesn't mean that you get through a 100s list and you're done. You're always, you always have a new 100s list, okay? And after you get through those people, those people are on the back corners, and then you have a whole new 100s list, all right? So, um, and another way to network too is that if one of your friends, you ask them and they say no, then be like, okay, well, do you have a friend that I don't know that's in your life that you feel like could use this business and it would be a blessing? Do you have a friend like that? And your friend, if they're a friend at all, they're going to be like, okay, well, let me think about it and I'll let you know. Or maybe they have somebody come into mind right away, you know? And so anyways, you've got hairstylists, you have massage therapist friends. Talk to those people. They can incorporate the wrap into their business. They can incorporate our supplements with hair, skin, and nails. There's so many people out there that you know that could use extra money. Um, all right, so we're posting. We're messaging people. You have to message people every single day. That's part of this job. And if you want to make 10000 a month, then you need to do it before you're making it. If you don't do these things, then you're not going to make the money, okay? So you have to do it in order to make it, all right? Okay, so message, post, and then the last one is so important is follow-up. The average person needs like seven to 10 times um, to follow up with them in order to say yes, okay? And so like, it doesn't mean, if somebody says, no, I'm not interested, remove them off your list, okay? Like, if th that's like a hard no. I'm like, that's a no, no, you know? And if the, somebody's like, well, you know, I, I don't know. Okay, that's a maybe. Follow up. That's a follow up list person. Or, well, you know, I've been really busy, um, so I can't right now. That's not a no. That's a just not right now. Okay, that's a follow up person. All right, so follow up is really, really, really important. All right, so message, post, follow up. It's the trifecta of social media. And if you don't do one of these things, okay, if one's missing, or two are missing, you're not gonna be able to be effective on social media. You've gotta do all three, all right? Do we got it? Post, message, follow up, all right? So, and then have a notepad, all right? Like, I, I will lose track if I do not write names down. So buy a notebook, and then just write names down. Say the date, when you talk to them, and that will keep you so organized. Just keep it so simple. You know, Sally, Joe, uh, March 13th, or, you know, Friday, she gets paid next month, um, follow up with her on this date, you know, like make notes and then draw through them. That was something I've learned from Lori Conway. She's our ambassador upline and she's been a top 10 income earner for the last like five years in a row, top 10 income earner. And, uh, she showed me like, she's got like a page of like 35, 40 notes. And there's like 10 people on every page with all this information. And that's how they stay organized and they are able to follow up with that or otherwise they'll always forget who they talk to. Okay. So hopefully that will help. Um, there is one other thing. Oh, we've got to breeze through this. You guys, two more minutes. Okay. Um, well, well that's it. Should I talk about I closing the deal? Oceans next. Samantha. Okay. Um, so we're going to talk about, I think a lot of the times, like what I was confused was, I don't know what to say when I message people. So some of you, that's where you feel stuck. Cause we have to message people. You will not grow your business just by posting like Rachel said. So, um, it's like, well, what do I say? And I remember sending like novels in letters to people and it, you know what they deleted it. Like they're going to ignore you. So you want to keep it short, sweet, and simple. Um, so I'm going to give you like sample things that you can say. Um, but the most important thing is you have to be yourself. So if this is something you would never say, don't say it, say word it in a way that's you because people know you, they, they want you to be genuine. Um, so the first thing is, um, I'm going to read you a message that I sent. So the first thing is when I've never talked to somebody before, like maybe I've been following them on Facebook and, I just I, think they're amazing and I'd love to have them on my team, but they don't know me. So that's kind of like awkward, right? You don't know me, but I really think you're cool. <laughs> like, um, I'll just say something really simple and I, it's so genuine. It's from my heart. Like, 
hey girl, I know we don't really know each other, but I love following you. I'm so glad we've become Facebook friends. Um, look, this might be super random, but I think that you would be so amazing do what I, doing what I do. And I'd love to do this with you. Would you be interested in making extra money? That's good. I didn't mention the business. I didn't give her an overload of stuff. It was just really short, sweet, and simple. And now if I'm doing my job and posting every day, she's going to be like, what do you do? So she's going to go to my Facebook and start seeing my posts and what I do. And, you know, a lot of times they're like, yeah, tell me more. What exactly does it entail? And then we, we keep the conversation going. So that's kind of my, my opener. Um, the other day, Cami was actually doing, did you guys watch that live with Cami Dempsey? It was so good. But she also gave some really fun scripts that you can use. And so um, she was saying, okay, so if, because we, we all have these people that like maybe they, you know, work, they're kind of on our chicken list. It's somebody that we love to do this business with, but we're too chicken to message them, right? I, we all have those people. So one day I was just like, I'm going to conquer my chicken list. I'm going to just do, see what happens if I reach out, reach out to all those people and I actually ask them to do this with me. So I usually send that message. Um, one thing Cammy said was, hey, if I could do this business with anybody and I do meet anybody, it would be you. That's all she said. And, and she got a ton of replies. Like, how sweet is that? I know if someone sent me that, I'd be so like, even if I wasn't interested, I'd be like, wow, that was so sweet, you know? Um, so if, so then for somebody that maybe you've talked to them before and they kind of said no, or they ignored you, you could say this, what's it going to take for you to do this business with me? Why not? What's the worst that could happen, right? They're going to say no again. Um, maybe, so I've had people, especially even with our, you know, with the BOGO we just had for signing up, I had people that were like, I'm signing up right now. And they went MIA. I know some of you guys had it too, right? So one thing that you could message them is, hey, on a scale of one to 10, one being I'm out, leave me alone, and 10 being I'm in, where do I sign? Where are you? And a lot of times they're going to end up replying, well, I'm about a six. And okay, so what can, we, what can we do to get you from a six to a 10? Like, why are you a six? What's going on? And then they'll start to talk, well, I'm just worried that, you know, I don't have a lot of time. And then you can talk about that with them. Um, and then for those that are just not ready to join yet, it's just not time, you can say something like, hey, since you're not ready to join, why don't we go ahead and get you started on a couple of our products so you can get your own amazing results. Then whenever you want to upgrade and become a distributor, you can. I just sent that to someone today because, um, again, she was like wanting to sign up, then went MIA. So I sent that to her and she's like, yeah, I was thinking the same thing. I'm going to order Wednesday when I get paid. So now I'm going to get a loyal customer, which is awesome, right? So, you know, it's just like short and sweet. You don't want to overload people with way too much information or you're going to scare them off. I, I ignore messages that are just way too long and it's about, you know, a product or something. Um, and then, of course, we always want to be following up, like Rachel said. So the main thing, when you follow up, it doesn't always have to, because I, there's people where I'll message them and then it's kind of just me, like a few times. And it's like, I'm, I'm dangerously looking like a stalker, you know, I know you guys know what I'm talking about. And so usually that's when I'll just send something like, hey girl, oh my gosh, I love the last picture you posted of your kids. They're so cute. But I'll send it in a private message. That's actually a way to follow up without being like super direct and like, join my team, you know, like, oh my gosh, because now she's like, if, if, if we've talked before, she's kind of ignored me. Oh my gosh, that picture of your kids was so cute. Or, oh, that post you did today was so funny. Like, be genuine. Um, but you're keeping a relationship, you're keeping a conversation going, and you're reminding them of you and the business. So those are just good ways to follow up. Um, now Candy is going to talk about sealing the deal. Cause I know that's where a lot of people get stuck. It's like, well, I'm messaging 10 people a day. I post every day, but I just can't get them to sign up. And Candy is amazing at sealing the deal. So take it away. <laughs> okay guys. So, um, closing doesn't need to be scary or uncomfortable. Um, I think some people just get scared about this actual follow-up work. Um, but if you learn the process and you practice it even just a little bit, you'll learn that your results will improve dramatically over time. Um, okay, so once you've shown a prospect your opportunity, like you actually talk to them about the product, it could be over the phone, it could be at, over coffee, um, in Messenger, however you're talking to them, 
Um, the most important thing is being able to follow with, up with them effectively to make sure that you close them. That's probably the most valuable skill that you can get as a network marketer. So um, if you want to uh, sharpen any skill and, and, and develop any skills as a network marketer, you want it to be closing the deal. If you can't lead your prospect into making a final decision to get started with opportunity, then it doesn't matter really how many leads you have or how many events you do or how many people you message. So this is something you definitely want to spend time practicing so that you can, um, you know, actually grow your business and help people be successful as well. Um, and of course, the, the follow-up can be done however. For me, I find that the most successful way to follow up and close a deal is um, over the phone or over, you know, even over messenger. If I'm in person with them, that can work as well. But um, I feel like, you know, over the phone is something that's just fine. They get to hear your voice. I love the voice memo option on Facebook. You know, I, I sign a lot of people outside of the state, outside of the country. And so we don't have that opportunity to meet up. So I just, you know, send them a voice memo like, hey, I just want you to know that, you know, you can't, you popped in my mind. I just wanted to check in, see how you're doing. Still think you'd be, you'd rock out this business, like whatever, you know, but they hear your compassion. They hear you're genuine. So I'm going to give you some tips on what you can say, what you can do to, um, show, to, to close the deal. So, uh, the one that Sammy just gave on the scale of one to 10, that's one that I definitely use. So I'm going to go move past that and say, um, you know, based on what you've just seen, if you were to get started with this company on a part-time basis, approximately how much would you want need to earn a month in order for this to be worth it for you? I say that to a lot of people because I think some people just need to be like, well, you know, they might, you, in your mind, you're thinking they're just not interested, but now they're really put in a position to where they're really thinking, well, if I'm going to do this, if, in order for it to be worth it to me, I would need to make at least $500 a month or $1,000 a month, whatever number there is their number. But I also need to know as their sponsor and their enroller so I can put a game plan together on how that's going to happen. If they tell me they need to be making $6,000 a month, it's going to look, my mentoring with them is going to look a lot different than $500 a month. Um, and also too, I want to think through and talk through like, okay, well you have two jobs now. So how is this going to happen? What are you going to work in what time? So, um, it's, it's borderline like an interview process. Cause I also don't just want to sign anyone. I really want to partner with people that are serious about their business and that when I, you know, I can coach them to being successful and that they're receptive. Um, the second thing that I also say is approximately how many hours would you commit to each week to develop that kind of income? So once they've told me how much, you know, I want to know how many hours they're like, Oh, I can do, you know, you know, 10 hours a week. Okay. Well, and I talk about their current schedule. You work this many hours right now. You know, the kids are super active. So, so what time frames? I'm already getting them to think in their mind when they're going to work their business. The last thing I'd want anybody to do is sign up and then feel like they were set up for failure and really turn around and say, wow, I'm too busy. I can't make this work. No, they thought through those things beforehand. So we talked through some of those things. Another thing I say, if I could show you how to develop an income of whatever they said, you know, of, you know, $3,000 a month per month, uh, working however many hours they said, you know, 10 hours a week over the course of six months, would the, would you be ready to get started with this business? And a majority of them say, well, yeah, I mean, if you can tell me how to get there in six months and like that, I would be able to quit my full-time job and be able to be home full-time with my babies. And you think it's something that I can do then yes, I'm ready to get started. So it's really walking them through their fears. They don't know it's their fears, but you've got to be direct at what they're scared of. Um, I, I think that with her business, it's really not a financial one. Yes, some people don't have the $99 to get started up, but $99 is not a break or make or break for most people, um, even if it was their last $99, because it's not, you know, they didn't have to get massive loans out to get this kind of business. So there are deeper rooted issues, deeper rooted fears with people. For me, I had a big fear of failure. I was scared to death what people were going to think of me. If I went out there on Facebook after having this, you know, high level corporate job, I was scared of what people were going to misinterpret. Um, you know, the other thing that some people have a fear of not having enough time. So it's really working through these things. Um, at the beginning, I straight up told Sammy, I'm not going to post on Facebook. I'll be posting like beauty tips and like, you know, maybe if they're interested, they can buy with me because of that fear of what people were thinking of me. That was part of that. Um, and of course, once you start sharing and talking to people, you're going to guide them. I, obviously, I'm, I'm a totally different person today. I'm more confident. I don't care. People, if they're not putting food on my table and paying my debt, I really don't care what they think. <laughs> so it's taken time, but I had to get vision and get past through those obstacles. So 
um, just know like when you believe in other people, you've got to believe in them before sometimes for them because sometimes they don't even believe in themselves. Um, a lot of people that you get to minister this opportunity to um, have had a lot, a lot of life um, thrown at them. So uh, anyways, I just want you to know that this is something that can definitely, you know, it, it's, 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 it can be simple. Um, as long as you're excited and confident and I, I have believe in this saying, fake it till you make it. You just got to be excited and be expectant and um, people feel that confidence and that energy and the fire. You know, if you stay close to the fire, you become the fire. And so now we're going to move on. I think the next one, sorry guys, this is going a little bit longer than we wanted. So we'll probably breeze through these. Um, I will. Okay. Um, so wrap parties, you guys, uh, basically we've talked through er how, how you're earning your money. Uh, having a hundreds list. Sam talked about getting a launch party set up. And so basically like mine is about wrap parties, but I, I'd love to talk about that on a, another day. Um, but I do want to say one thing about the wrap parties is that I do truly believe that doing a launch party is really important. And if you can get it booked in your first two weeks into this business, it's like legit, you know, you're like doing this real thing. So even if you're just have it at your house, invite everyone, you know, and just say, I'd love to launch my business with you. Would you be willing to come? Don't do a group message. Please just text people one-on-one, -on -one, um, or give them a call and invite them to come over. It's free to come over. Okay. H like have some healthy things, have some hummus, vegetables, fruits, whatever. And then, you know, you're, you've got a catalog there in your box You've got some wraps. You can offer to wrap a few of those women if they'll come over or guys or girls or whatever at a discount and they can pay that for you there if they'd like. And then you just go through the product and basically like just, you can always search Lori Conway wrap party on YouTube. Okay. Or search Stephanie Dunn and that's S T E F A N I Stephanie Dunn D U N N wrap party. Cami Dempsey wrap party. Maybe Samantha could like write those out while I'm talking really fast, like their names. Um, but you could just YouTube them. You guys, that's all I did. I YouTubed wrap party and their name. I literally just watched a few, got the idea for it, feel for it. And then I just did it myself. I had no idea what I was doing, but I did it. And I really think that action of doing is just so important in this business. Even if you don't sell anything, just do it for your own sake of like starting to step out, starting to talk about the products. And the more you do it, the better you're going to get. Okay. So even if one person comes still do it. All right. Um, so get that on the calendar and start YouTubing and watching those videos. All right, Samantha, you can close us up. Yeah. So the last thing I'm going to talk about is the importance of getting plugged in. You guys, you are business owners. So, you know, we would never start, like Rachel was saying, like a brick, a brick and mortar building, you wouldn't open a donut shop and have it be a chain and then never connect to the main corporate. You just wouldn't do that, right? You have to stay connected. Every Sunday night, we have our corporate family call. Um, it's an incredible time to hear from our CEO, from our CNO, and, um, and, and all of them, and just hear about what they're doing, special promotions they're going to be having, just it, just all sorts of stuff. So you want to make sure you get on that family call. On Monday nights, it's a show me the money call. Um, this is where you're going to hear from other top earners, like their testimonies. They're going to give business tips on how to make money. Again, we all join to make money. Um, and then we have some amazing you know, events happening all around right now. We have One Team, One Missions. Um, if you go to events.itworks.com, you're going to see uh, the boot camps that are happening. There are some, these huge boot camps. They're like giant trainings. If you are within an eight hour driving distance of one, you've got to go. Um, because they're going to be pivotal in helping you to understand the business, the products, all of our, our CEO is going to be there. I mean, they're amazing. The one team, one missions are like giant wrap parties. They are everywhere. They're happening. I mean, if you look on the corporate calendar right now, it's like almost daily. There's a one team, one mission somewhere. So look and see if there's one close to you. Um, you can bring guests free and I promise you, if you bring guests, they're going to end up signing up with you. They will, because they're going to be so excited after that. Um, and it's like a giant wrap party, but again, your guests will be like, okay, sign me up now. Um, so get connected to those. And then lastly, you need to download the wired app. If you haven't downloaded it yet, you need to do it. It is a free app. I'm going to show you what it looks like. 
So it's called Wired. Can you see the lights kind of reflecting not good? Um, eh. So it's just called Wired. It's an It Works app. It's free. This is an amazing app, you guys. You need it. It's going to alert you when there's corporate calls. So you, you will get a no notification. All you have to do is click it, and you'll be on the corporate calls. It happened on Sunday night or Monday night. You can also look up um, Mark Pentecost, our CEO, or Pam Souter, our CNO, and they're also going to have the links to our corporate calls. So um, it's so easy to get connected. There's no excuse. The other thing, um, the Wired app also has a link to the events that are going on for the one team, which, so it's really easy. You don't have to go to a million different websites. And then it's also gonna have the information on getting your go bonus. So it's gonna have um, your time limit because we all started at different times. So depending on when you started, it's gonna tell you, you have X amount of time to go diamond. Um, you have this many days left to get your $10,000 bonus or your $5,000 bonus. So this app is incredible. You need to download it. Um, I think that's it. Uh, oh, we covered I think we're so excited. Yes, go for it. Oh, go ahead. No, oh, I just had one other thing to add to the calendar. What is it? Um, on Thursday, we have a Zoom with Genevieve Sykes. Oh my gosh, so I'm so excited. That's going to be at 9 p.m. Central Standard Time. She's an ambassador diamond, and she went ambassador, you guys, in less than a year. Woo! Talk about, mm -hmm. long, like, I mean, creating a huge fire that's, like, out of control, Okay. Um, that girl had momentum and we're going to learn how she did it, what she did. And regardless of how long you've been in this business, you guys, um, oh my gosh, like to go ambassador in one year time, I truly believe anyone can do that at any moment. Um, or, or like in their own timeline, but oh my gosh, like if we could just pick up some golden nuggets from her, then it's going to be amazing. So Thursday night, okay. Uh, at 9 PM. Central Standard Time. And if you don't know your, your time zone, just Google it. 9 p.m. Central Standard Time. And then what your time zone is, you'll figure it out. Okay. Um, and then I'll write her name here so that you guys can see it. And then if Samantha had anything else. Yeah, no, I was going to say, make sure you stay plugged into your team page, whether you're on uh, Rachel's Minor Candies. Um, stay plugged in. You can ask questions on it. That's what it's for. It's to encourage you, to help you. Um, stay plugged into the Zooms that we have. We do it for you guys. And then we're going to be doing this new distributor training every other week. Um, we're going to be doing it on Sunday. So as you start adding people to your team, just make sure we'll, we'll post it on Facebook. So just make sure that you're getting them on this so that, you know, they can start their business up and running just like you are. So we're so excited that you guys were on with us tonight. Um, I can't wait to see what happens with your businesses. I know each one of us, when we joined, we never imagined we would be where we're at today, you know, in the top 75 in Ambassador Diamond. Like, we were all just kind of hoping for that extra three to 500 a month. That's what would change our lives. And so you just never know what this will do for you. And I promise you that if you just stay consistent and you just give this your all, like, your entire life will change. So I love you.